An object-oriented spatial display allows a user to observe 3D objects from any direction. The eyeball is a new display of this type. This is the developed system. Since it is spherical and transparent, it looks like a crystal ball and is very attractive and expressive. First of all, I will explain how images are displayed in the ball. Images are displayed on a monitor and then transmitted to a mirror, mirror one, in the ball by the combination of mirrors and lenses. The optical system is designed so that the transmitted images focus on mirror one. A viewer observes images focused on mirror one and feels as if the monitor is virtually placed within the transparent ball. The images are reversed because of the construction of the system. Images in the ball are distorted under the influence of the lenses. This distortion varies from viewpoint to viewpoint. Therefore, we observe different images with the right and left eyes and feel the illusion of depth sensation caused by this disparity. Let's move on to interactive applications. She is enjoying interacting with the eyeball. She waves her hand to a robot in the ball. Then he waves back at her, like this. Let me explain how we realize such interaction. Images of the viewer can be captured from the back side of the system through mirrors and lenses, like this. Though captured images are reversed and turned upside down due to the system's composition, they are still useful for interaction purposes. According to the motion of the observer's hand, 3D computer-generated animation is rendered and the ball is rotated effectively. According to the motion pattern of the hand, the system displays images and controls the direction of the ball in real time. Don't hit him, he's not so strong. By the way, the system can also rotate the ball latitudinally from minus 15 degrees to plus 30 degrees and longitudinally from minus 130 degrees to plus 130 degrees. This is the stage unit. This feature extends the applicability of the system much more. Let me show you one of the examples. The eyeball can be utilized as a video conferencing application. The person at the distant place can control the direction of the ball so that it looks like he is turning his head during the communication. What is important here is that the mirror in the ball does double duty as a reflector for both displaying objects and for capturing the viewer's behavior. As a result, the optical system in the eyeball can easily realize the gaze awareness, like this. We are planning to develop some more applications in the near future. For example, it is obvious that the eyeball system is useful for displaying 3D object movies like QuickTime VR. Here, the object is rendered according to the direction of the ball. The future direction of this study will be one that encompasses both approaches for interaction and for communication.